My name's Ash. I'm 17 years old. I use he, him. As a trans student, oftentimes I encounter a lot of bigotry and oppression in different ways, like comments about the gender neutral bathroom we fought for, um, comments about trans bodies, making fun of Oliver and Cox, or calling um, Caitlyn Jenner just the man and drag. And like, a lot of kids get bullied for being trans, and there's really terrible statistics about trans people not even making it past age 23. I actually got kicked out of my house for being transgender um, when I was a junior. And I'm currently living with my foster parents that are super supportive, but it's real. My name is Rhea Jones. I'm 16. My gender pronoun is she, they. At South, people a lot of times say that it's kind of like a liberal bubble inside, you know, a liberal school, inside a liberal neighborhood, inside a liberal um, city. And I think a lot of the Homophobia and transphobia and all that stuff is really kind of suppressed and, and hidden in South and so I think surveys like this really um, bring out the, the truth of what people really think and believe, which I think is really important. I was expecting some like confusion of like, um, is being transgender a choice or not like completely supporting gender neutral bathrooms, but I wasn't expecting just blatant polar opposite answers. A big one would be that being transgender is a phase that people grow out of or just is good for attention or just something on Tumblr or like things like that and they don't see it as valid, they just see it as a kid just hopping on a trend. Like seeing kids and take it less seriously when somebody does come out to them and if they do take it seriously they kind of shun them and just like take them out of a clique or group that they're in. I hope that there are people that saw the survey and um, want to learn more about gender and stuff. Um, I think that the impact on the school will really come after like we discuss the answers with, with groups you know, inside South and like with the community inside South. I think it's okay if you don't know everything about the LGBT community. You just have to try. Be okay with discomfort. You're going to have some. Um, and it's okay for you to look dumb and not know things and you don't have to tiptoe around somebody. You can just say, um, I really don't know this and I want to know this. Um, and honestly, most of the times people are fine with that.